when I left Sydney to come and to, to become an artist, and, and this was my dream to travel Australia and be, become an artist, um, I set off in, a, in an old Toyota Hiace. Uh, I fitted it out and had the, all the gear in it and a bit of a novice. I didn't know how I was going to live. I was driving around Australia and I got to Lightning Ridge, to tell you the truth, and, it's, and it happens to everybody in Lightning Ridge, you fall in love with the place. Um, I did fall in love with the place and, and stayed here for many years living in my car. I built my camp. The car I had for probably 10 years and, and it was you know, getting older and older and it had done the miles. I opened up my first art gallery um, at the site of the old car and that was my shingle. I needed something to draw attention to where I was positioned and you know, let my sign, John Murray Art Gallery. So I turned my old house, if you like, in, and car into a, um, a plane and stuck it up on a pole and, and it sort of blinks at night time too. So that then was the John Murray Art Gallery, the sign for the John Murray Art Gallery, which was pretty different at the time when I did. I did that in, uh, probably 15 years ago. I paid about $800 for that car um, over 20 years ago, 25 years ago, and I think I've got my money out of that. <laughs> I do not have a gallery in Silverton. That is my good friend, my good friend Peter Brown. He, uh, we met 20, over 20 years ago and we, we painted together for a few days. Uh, we had a great deal in common. What we did find that we liked the outback, to, you know, like, and we both had a sense of humour. He was painting in Vegemite colours at the time and he was called the Vegemite artist. He painted, just would, used to smear on brown paint, brown Vegemite and cut it off and that was his, um, painting and I was totally different I've always used color and I've built my color up so there's two distinct differences we're not the same person as um, people think we are